اعوذ باللہ من الشیطان الرجیم بسم اللہ الرحمن الرحیم تھیم اینڈ سبجیکٹ کیپنگ ان ویو دس ہسٹوریکل بیک گراؤنڈ اٹ بیکمس کوائٹ آبیس دیٹ دس سورا واز سینڈ ڈاؤن ٹو سرو دا مائیگرینٹس ایز اے پروویژن فار دیئر جرنی ٹو ہبش ایز اف ٹو سے دو یو آر لیونگ یور کنٹری ایز persecuted emigrants to a Christian country, you should not in the least hide anything from the teachings you have received. Therefore, you should plainly say to the Christians that Prophet Jesus Islam, was not the Son of God. After relating the story of Prophet John and Jesus Islam, in verse 1 to 40, the story of Prophet Abraham Islam, has been related. verse 41 to 50 also for the benefit of the migrants for he also had been forced like them to leave his country by the persecution of his father his family and his countrymen on the one hand this meant to console the immigrants that they were following the footstep of prophet abraham and would attain the same good end as that Prophet uh, ﷺ did. On the other hand, it meant to warn the disbeliever of Makkah that they should note it well, that they were in the position of the cruel people who had persecuted their forefather and leader Ibrahim ﷺ, while the Muslim emigrants were in the position of Prophet Ibrahim Islam himself. Then the mention of the other prophets has been made in the verses 51 to 65 with a view to impress that Muhammad sallallahu alayhi wa sallam had brought the same way of life that had been brought by the former prophets but their followers had become corrupt and adopted wrong ways. In the concluding passage, verses 66 to 98, a strong criticism has been made of the evil ways of the disbelievers of Makkah. While the believers have been given the good news that they would come out successful and become the beloved of the people in spite of the worst efforts of the enemies of the truth alhamdulillah today we completed our study of surah maryam may allah bless us to tread on the path as explained and 